you tell me what you did before you had to sign on? I was a street sweeper. And how many years have you been a street sweeper? Oh, about 18 months. About 18 months. Yeah. What did you enjoy about doing the job? Uh, basically, uh, you had the most, well, hopefully, the freedom. Uh, nobody on your back. You need to see what, what, what the job needed to be done and just getting on with it. So why do you think that you've been made redundant? Government cutbacks. Nobody's coming into the city, so nobody's been cleaning. So what are they going to put in place of the road sweepers? That I couldn't answer. I don't know. I'm not working for them now, so I couldn't sell it. The, the, the Scarab vans or...? Probably. Uh, they're going to probably try and rely on technology to do it. Uh, but I don't think technology will work. That's my opinion. How many road sweeps have been made redundant? They were well, after uh, 60 altogether. Uh, there was 18 of us, well, only 14 of us finished up after, from on temporary contracts. So, do the maths. How many years in Liverpool have you had road sweepers? How, how, how far does the history go back, would you know? Well, no, but I assume uh, probably Victorian times. In the Victorian times. And now, officially, there are no more road sweepers. Uh, there will be road sweepers, but they won't be doing the job the way it used to be done. Okay. So what are you what are you looking forward to in the future now, employment-wise? Uh, probably at my age, probably something part-time, um, and probably school hours. Have you organised a good pension plan for yourself? No. I've never been in an, in an employment uh, where, where pensions have um, been part past. So are you going to accept the fact that, yeah, in your old age, you are going to be basically living on the poverty line? I don't accept that, but I probably it's probably going to be close to reality. Would you consider doing charitable, voluntary work just to keep yourself busy? Yeah, I mean, yeah, uh, my wife mentioned that on a few occasions. And yeah, I've got a few ideas on doing that. So, have you got grandchildren? Yeah. So what do you think the future is? For the young people now there because youth unemployment has been the highest it's been in probably 20 years it's it's hard for them i mean there's there's i mean this this government for all its protestations about wanting to be um all inclusive and we're all in it together it doesn't appear to be that way really. um, anyone under 25 seems to be getting uh, a real battering off them and we're the fourth richest country in the world, and we've got people, um, quite honestly, dying of hypothermia and going to food banks for, for, for handouts. That's not a way to run an economy. It's not a way to run a business.